outside. This was a previous client. We did their landscape. Now they would like a pergola. So we're gonna give them some shade. On a another job today this one we're just doing a field mowing uh, we do that as well so with here we're just out here with brush hog cutting all this field pretty big area I think total I think they said it was something like 40 acres or something like that so just got started I'm actually just meeting the guys out here they've been out here all morning probably gonna be out here for I don't know a few more days so I'm just mowing away but yeah, we uh, we do field mowing or lot mowing, a vacant lot, anything like that we can do. So out shopping today. One of our previous videos, as y'all saw, we uh, had a couple of our rider mowers go out on us. They've got a lot of use, so, you know, as much as I want to cry about it, which I probably will cry, it's probably time to get them changed anyways. So, at a certain point, you know, you can only use something so much, the maintenance expenses start to pretty much overcome the cost of a brand new one. So, looking at that, you know, we've had a couple of them in the shop a lot. One of them is still probably worth fixing, but I think I want to... Home Depot actually had some zero turns that might, they're about double the price, but I think it would still be better in the long run. You know, I know they're not quite commercial material or commercial equipment, but you know, it seems like it would last us a little bit longer. We could always use it for a field mower or mowing weeds or whatever. So I don't know, we'll see. See what I figure out, but yeah, we gotta figure something out. Look at these kayaks doing. See that? What the heck do you need kayaks for in New Mexico? I can understand in Washington, you know, our other location up there, there's water all over. I actually like to kayak. It's one of my favorite pastime things. When I do have pastime, I really don't ever get much time off of work. Just juggling these three locations, you know, Roswell, Las Cusas, and, and Everett, uh, Washington. But when I did, I used to love to kayak, so. I don't know why you need kayaks here in New Mexico. We don't have much water, so that's kind of odd. Anywho, I go back to Home Depot, check prices over there, and of course they're already closed. Places are closing early with everything going on in the world right now, so we'll have to stop by tomorrow and see what they have. So, yeah, gonna buy a rider mower just to get us through for now, and uh, we can make a better decision later. So, we'll keep at it. Guys are here today. We're trying to get this house cleaned up. Coming through for this customer, a new customer. The yard is just kind of overrun with weeds and kind of got a little uh, out of hand for her. So she's having us come in and give it a full uh, spring cleanup. Full or get all the weeds cut down, the gravel areas, lawn area, try to get it back into shape.
smile, you know that, right? Yes, I do. Hold on. If you fall off, I'll catch you. It's all right in my arms. Hey. <laughs> You'll fall right in my arms. Like when I fell, like when I fell down from heaven. Okay, we are here at this job site. We got the pergola up. We just need to do a little more final touches, and we'll be good to go. Well, it's always good to work with the previous clients. So, a good addition to any landscape is a nice pergola. We're good. Another job well done.